Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I appreciate you stopping by. And of course, you got here just in time. That's right. It's Friday. And it's time for another edition of Friday's Finds. You'll notice that I'm actually indoors today. It's the middle of July in Texas. And we had a cold front. It didn't make things cold. It just cooled things down. Brought some rain, made it overcast. Lighting outside is horrible. So I'm gonna do some unboxing in here. And most of these products are indoor kind of things anyway. So let's get to it. Hey, if you haven't already, I'd be most honored if you'd consider clicking on that subscribe button. That really helps the channel grow. Just past 21,000. Whoa, that's amazing. Thank you for that. That's all you folks that have been following along, and I really appreciate it. I, I love that you share some of your time and attention with little old me. Say howdy. Click on the say howdy button down there. Let her, tell us what you like about Friday's Finds. Tell me what kind of products you like to see on Friday's Finds. Hey, post a comment down there if you've actually ever purchased a Friday's Finds item. I'm just curious. All right, let's start opening some boxes. I got a, I got a stack of them. And you can see that this, this one's already, somebody's already opened this one. It's actually, this is not a sponsor. This first item is necessity driven because when you live in a small space, space is at a premium. Cabinet space is at a premium. For years now, we've rolled with a set of dishes that never got used. They're, they were ceramic, they were heavy, they were round, and it, it was just, they rattled when we drove, they had to go in a drawer, they were too heavy to go. We didn't want to put them up here in this cabinet because they were heavy and we didn't want it to collapse. And so they've been riding in a drawer over there. They've been covered up, they were never used. So we decided to make a change. Several weeks ago, I was we, we were visiting with my mother, and she showed us a product, a plate that she had found online, and I thought, this, this, is, this is the most amazing thing. So here's the, the box. It is a wheat straw and plastic dinnerware set. Who knew? Wheat straw and plastic. But check these out. These are the bowls. Super light. This set includes six of everything. But somebody, she already opened the box and figured out what we're going, what we're going to keep, and what we're, what we're going to store, and what we're going to keep in the coach. We have six small square plates. Six large square plates and uh, the square is an important thing because I, I have no <laughs> I have no round cabinets anywhere but I got lots of square and rectangular spaces and these actually take up less space than the round we actually end up with a, a, just a better fit in the RV drawer. This is the, the cabinet that it's going in. So they all fit perfectly into this drawer. This is our whole kitchen now. So we have three different colors. We have the charcoal, the gray, and the beige. And Yappy says the charcoal and the gray are the ones that we will be using on a regular basis. Because it comes with the tumblers, I'll be getting rid of my actual glass, my water glass. Not only is it practical, but it's microwave safe. And it's hard, hard to believe that's wheat straw and plastic. Amazing stuff. Okay, 
Now that I've regaled you with wheat straw dinnerware, we're now moving into the sponsored product section of Friday's Finds. So let's kick it off with a, an organization solution. You got one of those bins or drawers, the junk drawer that's full of batteries, a bunch of 9 volt, AA, AAA, C cell. Yeah, well, I had, a, I had a company reach out to me and said, hey, we got a solution. Are you interested? I said, I, I, ab absolutely. I, I got batteries just everywhere. So, comes to us from Kiwi Photos Direct. They specifically identified photographers for this. That's why it's from the Kiwi Photos Direct. They said photographers absolutely have a... Now I'm a videographer, I'm not a photographer. Uh, but I, because I'm a videographer and I get a lot of Amazon products, especially a lot of flashlights, I have a lot of batteries in the truck, in the motorhome, in the green box. Hopefully this is going to remedy that so let's take a look i'm talking while i'm opening the box and not giving you that kinesthetic experience that asmr experience of opening packages nice heavy duty little plastic box oh check that out this even got stuff in it 10, 10x CR and then we have a tester it's a battery tester and we can hold it's like 30 doubles and 20 triple A's so let me locate some batteries let me go dig in that drawer and get some batteries and we'll take a look at this. Next, we actually have a returning sponsor to Friday's Finds. Y'all remember Uliber Magnet? Yeah, they've sent us some fishing magnets. Uh, we've had some magnetic koozies. and just, we, They've sent us some pretty cool magnetic stuff. Well, they, they said, hey, we got, we got something you, you need. You need this in the green box because I guess they've seen videos. It is, it's chaos in there. And if you don't know what the green box is, that's our my metal storage building. You can jump over to the RV Homestead Texas and learn all about the green box. So this is a magnet. This is from Uliber Magnet again, and it is a organization solution. A magnetic tool holder that's that's one big magnet right there and we'll have to take this out to the green box and put some tools some screwdrivers in it but that's i want to give a shout out of thanks to uliber magnet for thank you uliber magnet for always reaching out to me you guys have some of the coolest stuff Any, anything to do with magnets is cool product number four it's a new new sponsor, a new company. We've not ever worked with them before. This is um, Malakasa Chic. Malakasa Chic. Malakasa Chic. And they sent, they sent us a box. Check out this box. This box contains ramekins. I think I think I know what a ramekin is. Not positive. Oh, looky there. That's a bit larger than I was expecting. I thought these were going to be smaller. These are from Mala, Malacasa Porcelain. They are 
microwave safe. I think you can actually even put these in the oven. I gotta find something to prepare now. These will be great. Cereal bowls, ice cream bowls. Speaking of ice cream, that gives me an idea. Yeah, so let me put the thing together and then we'll we'll work with these. We'll, we'll work with these right here. Yep, okay. One more package to open. This little box is from Wargo. W-O-R-G-O, Wargo. Wargo. It's from Wargo, right there, yeah. And this is kind of cool. This is the T6 Wireless it's from Tozo, the Tozo brand. So Tozo, 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 Tozo has sent us <laughs> something very cool. In case you don't know, I, I wear hearing aids. My hearing aids provide me with stereo telephone. And, I, and it's gotten to the point where I, I can't talk on the phone without having audio in both ears. Uh, so this is of great interest to me. These are, because occasionally my, my hearing aids have to go to repair, be repaired. So these intrigue me because maybe, just maybe, they'll work in a similar fashion as my hearing aids. So I'll be able to have com phone conversations and and listen to YouTube videos and all of that fun stuff. Power cord. Of course we have owner's manual. We have little ear pieces that go on there. Oh, look at that. The case is the charger. Oh, very, very, very compact. Very, very nice. I like the packaging. So let me educate myself on this. I'll, I'll find her some batteries. Uh, some screwdrivers, something to cook, and some music to listen to. Not sure how I'm gonna do the video on that. I'll figure it out. Don't go away. Got a, got a mess of some batteries. Let's see what we can do with them. Ah, they are. They're for small 10 x button cell batteries. I don't, I don't know if I have any of those. But I do know I have some triples. Are they actually going to fit? I have some doubles. There's triples. Yep, the triples fit. We can test them. Put it in. So we're hot. We're hot. We're hot. Triples. You see, this, this is what happens when they ride around in the back of the truck. There it is. I, th I think this is a most handy. It's watertight. So I can actually put that in the back of the truck. And I don't have to worry about the batteries going everywhere because I got more batteries in the back of the truck. I just, because <laughs> they fell out of that. Winner, winner right there. All right. There's my mess of screwdrivers. It started raining. Kind of noisy. 
clean it up. I like that we can put the nut drivers in there as well. Eighteen screwdrivers. And you can see the length of them. Of course, you know, it, yeah, you'll like it. I know I do. Very handy. I actually put several like that on there. Now we gotta go do something in the kitchen. Yes, the air conditioner has kicked on. It's starting to get warm. Remember I told you this makes a would make a great ice cream bowl lunch. Mm. Like the perfect size. So I think I'm going to make like an egg custard. I think I'm gonna make an egg custard. Because I'm making a whole lot of this ice cream. I end up with a whole lot of egg whites. And I've been thinking about how to utilize those. In a decadent fashion. I'm working with the, the earbuds. I've paired them to my Galaxy phone. Let's see if we can find. I'll figure out how to <laughs> convey this to you. So here, here's the way I'm gonna do this. I have So that's that's the newest dude RV video. That actually worked out pretty good, giving you the the audio. It's close. I mean, you're not getting stereo through my my hero setup here. These are actually waterproof. It's, it, it you don't want to go swimming with these, but according to Tozo's and all the Tozo information. You, you don't have to worry about getting these wet. You can shower with them. You can sweat on them. Just don't submerge them. They're not a diving apparatus. <laughs> don't go diving with these. You actually can talk on the phone. Let's, let's do a test on the phone. Let's, uh, yeah, I'll do a test. For There's using the buttons on the earbuds, you're actually able to answer calls, return calls, you're able to control the video or the player. So, if you're watching like the YouTube, watching YouTube on your phone, you can control that by pushing the various buttons on your on your on your earbuds on the Tuzo earbuds. Now, I've just downloaded the app. Let me see if I can get you some insight into that. Uh, we'll see what the Amazon filter, how they feel about that. Sometimes the Amazon filter doesn't like phones and computer screens. So let me, let me work with that, and, and, and I'll be right back. It's pretty, pretty intuitive. So it determines which is in which ear and you can touch a control 
This shows you how to use it. We'll go back over here. We can go to things you can buy. So you can do some shopping right here. They have a community where you can hang out with people. They have music. All kinds of stuff that you can do in here. You can even connect directly to customer service for a chat session. Yeah, I mean, this is way more than I've... This is not... These, these are not just headphones. They're not just... <laughs> it's actually an integral part of communication. It These these do what... What these do. Except they don't... And you can actually go in and adjust. So if, if you're like I am and you have a, a cookie cutter hearing loss, you can raise, you have an equalizer. So you can adjust some of those higher notes, which is, I, I can't hear higher noises, the 20 hertz, 20 megahertz. Anyway, you can adjust it to fit your hearing style. These are awesome. I like that. I like that they come with a little charging case. Yeah. I bet Yappy's going to take them away from me, though. She really likes these kinds of devices. She really likes earbuds when she's working on the computer, so I'll have to hide them. <laughs> so we need to go in the kitchen and cook something. Found a pretty simple recipe where I can use all these excess egg whites and the ramekins. It's going to be real simple. Got two cups of, of whole milk. Going to mix that with a cup of egg whites, uh, vanilla. It calls for cinnamon and nutmeg, and uh, we have it, but I don't know where it is. So I'm doing it without. So I'm going to. I got the water heating up. We're going to do a water bath in the convection microwave. I've never used it. <laughs> so I'm figuring it out. So let me mix all my stuff up. We'll put in some good old pure vanilla extract. I bought that from a guy at a flea market the other day. Oh, it's so good. Uh, yeah, this is going to be like real vanilla kind of pudding. So let me, let me go to work. Hold on, hold on. So there's the ramekins in a water bath. Out of it, fresh out of the oven. Here's your wondering. I got an ice cream maker going. I'm gonna let these cool, and then we'll see what they taste like. All right, all right, all right. We have we have the dish. Now, what's in this dish does not reflect any any in any way, shape, or form on Mala Malacasa. Malacasa is not responsible for whatever is in this bowl, but they did provide me with a great vessel to prepare it in. I love this size. It's good for ice cream, cereal, cooking. Let's try this custard. I'm not sure what I was expecting. It's good. It's kind of like, um, number one, it's not... I need to add a little more sweetener to it. I think the cinnamon probably, the cinnamon and the nutmeg would have, would have complemented this custard taste real well. It has a bit of an egg white taste to it. This isn't a cooking show. <laughs> this is a product show. This worked great. All right. Now that I finished eating the custard, we are at the end of this edition of Friday's Finds. I want to give a special shout out of thanks to the vendors that all made this video possible. As I typically do, I will provide you with a link in the cards and in the description below. That link will take you to the Friday's Finds 
shopping list on the Dude RV Gear Recommendations page. Your business is most appreciated. And it would make a huge... It, it would be great if you could go and click on some of these products and at least visit the listing on Amazon so that the so that the vendors know that I'm sending traffic their way and they'll keep providing these cool things for us to explore. Got a got a really cool the next episode is going to be really cool too. So you're going to want to remember to click that subscribe button. Oh yeah, and remember hit that bell as well. That really helps a small channel grow. I would be most honored if you would consider clicking on that subscribe button if you've not already done that. If you've already done that, well, thank you so much. That's why we just passed 21,000 subscribers. Thank you. That's like a milestone. Every year we're, we're adding another milestone to this channel for our patrons. We are so grateful for your generosity. You guys rock. All right, y'all come back now, you hear?